Yo, lay, look at my face and what did you see? I'm on yo, lie, yo, lie. I know you shitting me. What did you do? This you said. All right, guys, welcome back to Smoke One. You have one. I started lighting up this thing, cut it and everything, and I forgot to press record. So, the, then it's just the usual what I do cut, light, and show you the cigar. This thing is very toothy looking. It's like sandpaper grid. But yeah, I, I didn't want this only one half, and I don't want to redo it. And yeah, so far, it's just a uh, woody cedar. Dark chocolate espresso on a few puffs. It's the sweetest cigar. It's like it have this sweet floral, fruity, dark stone fruit to it. On this little first that I've been puffing on. But yeah, it's very good. It's a very toothy wrapper. Haven't seen that in a while. And this is the Argan Norsa Leaf. Uh, Rare Leaf uh, Reserve of Maduro. And yeah, that's all you guys missed. Nothing much. So that's how I caught up on for you guys. But yeah, let's continue with the review now. I'll see you guys at the end of the first third. All right, guys, welcome back. We're at the end of the cigar. So, very espresso y, very dark note, but it's a lighter note as well. It's like sometimes dark, sometimes light. Uh, good sweetness, very barnyardy, dankiness, uh, sweet tobacco, coffee, coffee bean, cocoa powder, cinnamon, and a retro hill. Baking spice with sweet, sweet floralness. And the baking spice lingers. All right, let's take off that first band. Here's the first band. Rare leaf. Reserva. Good looking cigar. I love the flavor note. It's not too dark, but it's not too light. It have a saltiness on the smoke that's set in your tongue as well. And that's it for the first third. We'll see you guys on the second third. All right, guys, welcome back. We're at the end of the second, third. Look at this ash. It's toothy. This ash is so toothy. I don't know if it's going to show on camera, but it is. That's how toothy this cigar is. So, if you blow, if you, you smoke the cigar and you let the smoke out quick, it have the citrus taste. But if you hold it, it have a salty, cocoa, fudge, brownie, chocolate espresso it's a sweeter cigar it's a sweeter note on the retro hell all right toothy all right so i'm back so the retro hell red pepper spice with a barnyard in the background with a sweetness of a cocoa powder and a finish is like a sweet sweet floralness to it which is delicious this cigar is actually very very good like very enjoyable very good cigar and let's take off this band All right, here's the band, Arganarsa Leaf. Good looking band. But yeah, this cigar is actually turned out very good. It's, it kind of like amazes me. All right, I see you guys at the end of the cigar. All right guys, welcome back for the end of the cigar. So, there isn't really much transition from the second third to the final third to the end of the cigar. Um, the chocolate has left, it's gone forever. There's a, now there's a lot of white pepper spice on the retro hell with a little bit of a dankiness, musty, wet wood. And um, it's 
and on pellet, it's kind of flat tasting. It's like blind spot with no flavor on the final third. There's a couple of missing flavor here and there. There's some of them just no flavor, just tobacco, which is very disappointing because the first and second third were very nice. Even though it didn't change much, it didn't have that much crazy transition. It's a pretty much consistent cigar, but right at the final third, it's a disappointing because it, it go flat here and there. Yeah, and there's this little bitterness at the end as well. It's cigar get hot, but which is fine because I'm at the end. I'm nubbing, right? Well, almost nubbing. But yeah, it's a good cigar. First and second, third, chocolatey, uh, espresso, sweet, everything that you want to come with. Now it's more earthy, leathery, dirt tasting like. So yeah, I was hoping I had had really high hopes for this cigar that would score very high. But other than that, now it's just flat, uh, white pepper spice a lot, uh, a little bit of citrus, the coffee, the sweetness have gone away, and that's it. So I would rate the cigar from 1 to 10, <clears throat> because the final third didn't hold up, a 6. If it held up, it could be in the high 8, but it, it didn't hold up at all. It dropped dramatically. So I would say smoke one if you have one. And that be it for today. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe, like, and comment. And I'll see you next time. Yeah. Earthy right now. Alright.